Well, let's go farm a little more, I guess. This farming's fun. I'll also get to test out these new spells I basically picked up and see how good they are. And down we go. Alright, so we reached the big chest. There's the voodoo altar over there. Well, first things first, let's get these slabs over here, I guess, so... Put that there, go get these. I think I'll aim for the Scarecrow first, so... Let's just power up a little bit, and then go one, two, three. Reduces attack by that much. There's the mini-me popping out. One, two, Three, four. You don't kill all the debuffs, but you know, reduces his attack by a lot. Cavern needs to take a bit of damage now, I think, so. Everyone gets hit. You go down. We'll start going after this guy a bit. Let's go with, um... Just a whole lot of ba bash in this guy. They got so many busties guys, it's really annoying. Let's do that to him. Heal up a little bit doing that. Get rid of him. You can heal up yourself. You can armor up. We'll go with, uh, one, two, this might kill my unlucky, so, nope, we'll just hear him a little bit, I guess. Heal up a little bit, and kill him. I was actually a lot more comfortable than last time, you know, because, you know, my guys are a lot stronger. This really is a game where you want to basically farm out, I guess, a little bit to get, like, you know, more stuff. To make stuff a little bit easier for you. It just is, is how it is for this game, unfortunately. I want that chest. <clears throat> Let's blow up the things here. Put that there. We'll go get this. Get the goodies. 
All right, so there's my Scarlet Shield. So increases target's defense by you know whatever it consumes uh, health points. So. Alright, so basically I can, like, you know, consume health points basically to get people to shield. Let's see how this works. I'm not sure what I think about that. It's a nice boost, but I mean... It's painful. Let's do that a little bit, I guess. That's really painful to watch, so I guess, like, you know... Maybe later on it'll be a lot better. Like, perhaps I'll have like a thousand XP and I'll be worth it at some point, but I mean, not right now, it's not worth it. Not for sure, not, not at all. Power up. Blast them. That hurts. There's Sanctuary, so... Heal up a little bit. And down he goes. There's the chest. We got a third eye and our stuff. Put that there, maybe. Well, that was mean. Um... I'm gonna put that right there. I'll get over here. There's a lot of useless stuff in here I can't really use right now, so... Put that there. These are useless to me, not to him. He can do whatever he wants with them, I guess. Let's do that. Put those there. That's annoying. Boom. Something fun rotating now, all you want, I guess, right now. Blow that up and we'll get them. Get these two. Alright, well that's gone. this here. Put that there. I don't know why I can't put it down between these areas, so that's interesting. Put it there then. Oh, I trapped the gate. How nice of him. Why 
One, two, three, four, five. Let him come to me, I guess. It's really not letting me put him down in certain places for some reason. I'm not really sure why. It's not a really big issue, I mean, it's just no annoying. Put that there, maybe. Alright, you came to me, so you can die now. You know, this level is a lot harder when I basically didn't have access to Nephi right away. With her, it's a lot easier. And that helps a lot, being able to like, reduce his damage by so much. And some defense, why not? A 10 critical. Super effective. Let's get some heals up. And we'll do that to kill him. Perfect. Let's go up to the Voodoo Altar, I guess. And we'll just power up you. Just slash him. And... One. Two. Three, four. There goes the summoner. That of course her hurts a lot, but whatever. Damn, everyone's going after her now. Send that heal back in there for now. I'll make sure I kill it, so get rid of it, that. Okay, we got right back. Heal up, then. And Paul bars him. It would definitely be a lot better if, like, you know, the debuff and, like, the attack were all in one animation there. If you're a developer watching this, but whatever. Let's get this. That's annoying, but whatever. Heal up. Paul Vars him a little bit more, yes. There we go. Our charge. So, spend 50, um, you know, of this you get some, like, you know, defense, deal. I think that was worth doing, I'm not really sure. I wonder if those, uh, deal the permit, basically, if you get them. That could be a thing, they might not be permanent.
Let's drop that there. Blow up the stuff around it. You know what? Let's just get this stuff right now. Action point. Get over here. And kill him. Let's see here. I want to... Bless up, I guess. Ring of fire. Frost. Let's go with some banishment. Do this. And let's just kill this guy off quickly. Perfect. Power him up a little bit. Get some defense. Get some more defense. And do that. There we go. There's my pile of slabs. Man, it's gonna make me have to work my way back now. But whatever, get this. Hmm. Because why not? Let's blow this up. Do that. Get over here. You might be trying to link up these guys now over here. Get here. Let's pop these around. Get over here. This is where I need stuff to blow up. There's just so many walls to deal with at this point. Put that there, put that there. Put this here. Well, that's nice. Someone put the campfire there. Let's get this around over here. There, now I can get to the Scarecrow. Whoop, a lot of things can get to me apparently. Well, these guys are easy enough to kill. Hopefully. Ow. There's a summon going on right away. Power up your defenses a little bit. Smack on him. There we go. There's a Scarlet Shield again. I'm probably going to ditch this card, by the way, because it doesn't seem as useful as you know, 5 might be. This is not worth the cost for it, really.
Perfect. Lots of, you know, Lord attack on this guy. Ow. Let's see here. I'll go with, um... One. Two. Three. And four. There goes the summoner, finally. Let's do this. Heal up. Smack this guy a couple times. That helped a little bit. It does, it's situationally useful, it makes it a lure to attack some people, but I mean... It's a situation useful, so it's not that great. There we go. I gotta start healing him up now, I guess. Perfect, Vampiric Attack. Just what I want to see. Because, boom! I used the wrong person to do that. Well, whatever. Kill him. Was an ideal way of doing that, but it worked. Care of these guys. One. Power up. Hit. And hit. One. Two. Three. Hmm. Let's take the hit, hit, I guess, and we'll get a maximum of defense. Heal. Empiric attack. You know, let's notice something. You only heal as much as HP they have left, basically, if you do that, by the way, with, like, you know... I did way more than 10 damage to that guy, but I only got 10 HP from it. So, that's something to watch out for, I guess, with, like, you know, Empiric Strikes. You can only take so much life from him, I guess. I hope I have something to blow up, like, this wall over here, but whatever. Put that there. And... I just want to get rid of it, so I'm just going to power those guys up. There we go. All my slabs are out in play. I'm going to be cutting this close again, so if I really watch out for that, but whatever. Get over here. You might have screwed me there. I don't have a way of basically getting over to him now, I don't think. Because basically I was going to rotate this slab, but you know. That perfectly screws me. Well, thank you, Dungeon Keeper. Why not? I effectively don't see a way out of this. Um, you know, 
the situation basically as it is, so... I guess let's head to the gate. Truck play basically retrieved the first, you know, this run. You might have screwed me again. Should use an action point basically to, you know, get more stuff there, I guess. Well, I haven't really shown it off enough, but yeah, basically if you don't have enough, like, you know, tile space to do what you can, you get screwed. I guess I don't have to go for this path over here. And it's completely locked me over here. Well, that's unfortunate. I was gonna show it off, basically, like, you know, got nothing else. You run out of, like, tiles, you can't do anything. Event unreachable. Well, it just goes to show, you can't be, like, you know... You really have to, like, you know, try and ensure that the Dungeon Master can't screw you over, because they can. You know, I think I'll make this uh, in, in itself a run. I'll basically take out the other card I, I don't really want, and then, like, you know, that'll be it. That'll be, like, uh, just this, like, you know, and I basically got screwed over the Dungeon Master. Right then, so... Healing Litany is something I want to try out. We'll put that here. There's Healing Litany basically upgraded. I'll see you guys next time.